following Mr. Gachaga, Gachagua's Elias Gachieta's reckless statements to Raila Muludinga. Let me tell you this, Mr. Gachieta, because that is the best name that I can refer you. There is no any other name that I can refer you to. Mr. Gachieta, Baba is the most respected person in this republic simply because of the, some of the good deeds and good things that he has done to the Kenyan people. Baba has served in various capacity. Baba has served as member of parliament. Baba has served as prime minister of this republic. Baba has served as min, uh, mi, the minister of roads in this republic. Baba is an engineer. Baba has served as the ambassador you know, in the office of the AU. Baba has vied as the president of this republic. Baba has won several elections in this republic. Baba was the first person to be installed as the people's president in this republic. In the glare of the media, and while everybody was seeing and his supporters danced all across this country. And that thing will still remain in the records of this country. And it will go in the Guinness books of records as the first person who was sworn into office despite having another president in the position. All those things, you cannot match them. I hear you say each and every day that your role is to see how Baba behaves, and that is your role. Your role is to protect William Ruto, and your role is to attack Raila and to insult Raila each and every time. Let me ask you this. Baba is above you politically. Baba is above you financially. Baba is above you in terms of Solom uh, Solomonic wisdom. Baba is above you in everything. Therefore, the moment you keep on attacking Raila Muludinga and calling him names, that is the moment you keep on brand, uh, branding Raila Muludinga because you are trying to make him more popular. The publicity around him, the, the negative publicity and the positive publicity you are trying to give him makes him to be the topmost brand of a politician in this republic. Because remember... The wise man says that publicity is publicity. Whether negative or, posi or positive, it is publicity. Every day you talk about Raila. Therefore, with me today, I can say the most talked about politician in this Republic of Kenya is Raila Moludinga. So that is publicity that you have already added to him. That is a popularity that you have already added to Raila Moludinga. But let me warn you on this. The other day you said that Baba is not supposed to even to be greeted. Because ye ni mchawi, ye ni mganga, ibu ni kulize leo. Sababu li msalimia baba, si wewe pia leo ni mganga, si uli msalimia kwa mkono, wewe pia ni mchawi, si uli msalimia kwa mkono, wewe pia ufai kusalimia, hata rutu anafaku kuogopa. Sababu li fikia baba, uka msalimia kama huko onajua ni baba. So let me tell you that uh, you should uh, always check on your words. Whatever you are trying to discuss around Baba, Baba has got his supporters, Baba has got his followers, Baba has got his uh, 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 the fanatic, he has got a, a, the very big fanatic following in this republic, more than any other person. And lastly, uh, about uh, uh, the event around the climate change. I did talk about how Baba came and he was not invited into the meeting, but uh, he forced himself into uh, the room where people were and he wanted, he, he wanted to sit where some heads of states were sitting. So all those stories that you are trying to tell us. Let me ask you this. Was it a security lapse? Because uh, <laughs> the first thing that I can tell you is that Baba came very well and people saw him coming. He was being driven in his car, and his car stopped at where you are. His, uh, his uh, security guard, uh, Mr. Ogeta, opened the door, and Baba came out majestically from his car. And you saw him coming, and you went to greet him. You're the first person who went to greet him. Later on, he went to directly from where people were seated. 
Huh? He was received by Musafaki, who took him inside where he could later on find his, his seat to sit. Therefore, let me tell you that Baba did not force himself into the meeting, but he was invited by the AU chairperson who asked him to come because the Kenyan people did not want, to, want Baba to go there. You fear. You fear for Baba's presence in that meeting because you knew you had nothing that you were going to present in that function. That is why you never wanted Baba to come there because he was simply going to embarrass you and your leader, the so-called William Ruto. So that is why you, ref you, you never wanted him to attend that meeting. But I thank God that Baba is loved by God. Baba is loved by his people. Baba walks with God, and God is with Baba, and everywhere he goes, all his plans, if you plan, if you plan any bad thing against him, God plans something good about him, and that is how Baba ended up being into the meeting. Baba was given an opportunity to address uh, the delegates and the delegate the delegates and the, uh, to address the delegation and the delegates were so happy about his speech and the advice that he gave about the politics and how to control and even how to finish issues touching on corruption so baba is a gentleman and that i can tell you very well even if you talk about him that he forced himself into the meeting baba did not force himself into the meeting it is you people who welcomed him to the meeting in fact you are the the, the last person who is not even you are the last person who should not even talk about Baba's visitation into that forum because you are the person who who welcomed him and showed him who, uh, where to go. So don't speak ill about him. That we are giving you the last warning about.